Green Bay police still investigating after the sidewalk was vandalized outside new Habitat for Humanity homes on Walnut Street. Police are still looking at surveillance video, but tonight the homes were dedicated, ready for move in, thanks to community support. NBC 26's Shara Taylor has the story. It's the last thing anyone wanted. Six families moving into their new homes with hateful messages outside. After seeing the vandalism, Lock Construction donated the materials and their time to fix the sidewalk and driveway, all for free. Crews making sure everything was repaired before the ceremony, so families never had to see it. Um, it was, of course, an unfortunate incident for our organization, but we're just happy that it's been cleared out, cleared away, and we're able to celebrate today with those six families. Greater Green Bay Habitat for Humanity cutting the ribbon for six new townhomes for excited families. This is my American dream. Because this is a very beautiful house and I'm moving in. Over 300 volunteers helped build these homes starting in mid-September. NBC 26 participated in National Women Build Week working on these homes. The family also helped build their own home. Since uh, the beginning, we would uh, we started with the garages, you know, put in, putting up drywall, painting, everything, you know, just literally everything. The Greater Green Bay Habitat for Humanity has helped 103 families since it was founded in 1987. According to the organization, they have helped 3 million people nationwide. Keeping you connected, Shara Taylor, NBC 26. Again, Green Bay police are still looking for the vandals. Anyone with information is asked to call police.